Good day, Canadians. Um, right now it's, what is this? The end of August, 28th, I believe, 29th. And uh, I'm going to start planning out uh, this year's hockey rink in my backyard. Uh, I'm going to do quite a long, quite a long tutorial about what I know, and it's not what everybody else knows, and it's just my way, or that's about it. So uh, the first part is, uh, let's take a look at the measurements here. I'm just starting out with uh, one of those rink in a box things that uh, Nice Rink has. I live in Canada, so I got it through Costco. So I got the stakes in, I've measured it out 20 feet, I'm way over there, 40 feet. That's the actual ice surface. I think the liner they give you is uh, 24 by 45 or something like that. So I got a little slant on my uh, on my backyard. I don't know if you can see it that well. But uh, it is, it slants down towards the gate there. So right now I'm gonna make some marks on these uh, st stakes. I'm gonna measure from the ground how much ice I'm looking for. So from the base of that, I probably want like four to five inches up on the, the high side. And down that way, I don't know what we're gonna end up with, so I'm gonna use a string and a level. And I'll show you what you need for that, just to make sure everything is uh, level, because you don't want too much water and the pressure on the boards down there if they're weak, so I gotta strengthen them up, and that's exactly what this is gonna do. So let's take a look at what we need here. You need a trusty uh, sledgehammer. Obviously, you need some stakes in the ground need uh, a level, some string, measuring tape, and a marker. And uh, let's go check that out right now. So the first thing we're going to do is, uh, like I said, measure the high side and put down, I don't know, measure up at least five inches and uh, string out the string and go from there. So I'm going to do that right now. Okay. Got that done. I put some string up, and uh, at least I know now where I'm going to be. So let's take a look at this. Here's what uh, we're looking at here. From the one post, I got two strings. This one here is my low side. That one there is also going to be a low side, but not as bad. This one. Right here is going to be low, but not as bad. That one there, right there is my high side. That's five inches. So for from about five inches, and if I go crossways, because remember, water levels out, everything's going to end up right in this corner. So right where it's going to end up, you can see here, I got uh, three strings coming in on this. The one right there, that's from the left side, uh, the higher side, and that looks to me roughly about, let's see, from the ground up, you're looking at roughly 11 inches, 10 and a half, 10 and a half, 10 and three quarters. And the one coming from the far corner is 10 inches. And the one coming directly behind me on the other low side is going to be eight and a half thereabouts. So I can prepare at least prepare myself for uh, ten and a half, eleven inches of water here, and that's just the, like the, the first uh, pour into it. So I can make boards to accommodate it. I'm going to go with two foot boards. Two foot boards there would be good. But it's going to turn out to be okay, I think. Let me know what you guys think of the video. Up next, I'm going to build a $20, $25 rink rake. Check it out.